Hey everybody, it's Faith from Fire Sign Tarot. Hope everybody's well. We're doing the weekly reading for December 18th to the 23rd today. A little bit of a shorter time span because I'm doing the weekly reading early next week because on Christmas Eve and Christmas Day I won't be touching my cards. Religious holiday at all, you know. But either way, if it resonates, cool. If not, Check your moon rising or Venus sign reading if it's not resonating with your sun. We're doing this by the elements, and if you're not sure where your sun sign falls as far as the elements go, everything will be in the description box down below along with the timestamps. Keep in mind, time and energy are both fluid. All things can be vice versa. Might play out from the perspective of a cross watcher. Your cross watcher up in here. Thanks for stopping by. I appreciate it. If you're new, you can hit the subscribe button and the notification bell at some point if you think we're going to vibe and stuff and get along. That'd be awesome of you. If you're returning, welcome back. It's good to see ya. Anybody can hit the like button at any time. It all helps the channel. It all helps the videos to be circulated to those who may need the messages. So, oh God. okay. Hopefully that doesn't bother me too much and distract me, but we're going to see what we can do here. Right, let's invoke the cards and get them down for everybody. Heavenly Father, Mother of the Holy Spirit, Spirit Guide, Dark Angels, I ask for any messages you have for the collective and any viewers who might come view this video. Thanks for coming down and hanging out with us. I appreciate you. I'm grateful and thankful for this gift that I've been given and I ask that you help me use it to bring all querents to their highest possible spiritual good and put them on their highest possible spiritual path. Okay. We'll set these aside until we get to their respective signs. All right. Try not to bend these too much, but I need a top and bottom for you, so. We'll go over these at the end. Wisdom Oracle. They're staying, saying stop shuffling. So, okay. What do we got for fire? Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. <laughs> Something has stopped growing. Or there was never hope for growth to begin with. The challenge is death, allowing something to come to an end so something new to begin. Okay. It's coming in. Salty words. Possibly some bad attitudes. That conversation is not going to go well. Lack of forward movement. I'm not seeing that as a closing of a gap. I'm seeing that as something coming to a dead stop. 
Lack of emotional fulfillment. Nine of Cups reversed. Why? Someone no longer being able to hold back. An avoidance of conflict. Something not sparking off. Outcome. Three swords reversed, hermit reversed. I don't like that fire signs. That's Huh. Bottom of the deck, sun reversed, lack of happiness, lack of joy. <sighs> connection, lack of a connection. Could be a breakdown of a family situation for some of you. That, that's avoiding the process. Okay. Talk to me about Queen of Swords. Thanks. Oh. Seven of Swords reverse. Someone coming clean with the truth. Huh. All right. Well. Mm. Okay, you guys can't really see. Let me push that back just a little bit more. That's a little better. Mm, Queen of Wands reverse. Let me get a little jaded, a little ticked off. Yeah, I'm not seeing that conversation going well at all. Why the chair reversed? Moving on. Moving on. Six of Swords. Somebody may be packing up and moving out. Six of Cups reversed. Bad blood. Why the Nine of Cups reversed? Why the Nine of Cups reversed? Seven of Wands, combative energy. Somebody's standing up and doing what's best for them, regardless of the other person's feelings by the looks of things. Ten of Cups, do what makes them happy. Pro possibly what's doing what's best for the family overall, or for the situation. Okay, that's a weird set. Odd flex, for real. Let's talk about why it happened. Strength reversed. Draining, draining, draining. Possibly the holding back of emotions may have been draining and it went on a little bit too long. The King of Cups is not somebody who wears their emotions out on their sleeve. Page of Cups reversed. Yeah. For real. For real. Something was held back a little bit too long. And I think it all just kind of cut loose. Why the Five of Wands reversed? Why the Five of Wands reversed? 
Hi, Priestess. Three of Swords reversed. There it is. Why the High Priestess? Kind of in a Pisces or a Taurus you're dealing with. Possibly could have withheld information, trying to avoid conflict, trying to avoid heartbreak. Death cycle. Something gave. Something gave. Withholding. Withholding. Why the page one or yeah, why the ace of wands reversed? Nine of Wands reversed and the Two of Pentacles. Didn't spark, didn't strike, thrown in the towel. Why the Two of Pens? Why the Two of Pens? Thank you, Strength. Try to maintain strength. Try to keep balance. Just trying to keep it together. Talk to me about this outcome. Why the Three of Swords reversed is the outcome. Are we letting go of heartbreak here? Because I don't know what that hermit reversed sitting next to it. No, about all that. Five of Pentacles. Remaining out in the cold. Yes, you missed this person. But it's just gonna it's just gonna be more bad attitudes and more piss and vinegar if you open that door back up. If anything deep down you know that. Why the hermit reversed? Nine of Pentacles reversed, four swords reversed. You have to isolate yourself from this person. This is a codependent situation that just makes you restless and it just causes problems. You need to isolate yourself from this person or this situation. These people, possibly. Queen of Cups at the bottom of the deck. Love yourself first. You have to ultimately do what's best for you. This is a family situation. You have to do what's best for everybody involved. This is allowing a death cycle to take place that may have been long overdue. All right, Three of Cups. I embrace joyful opportunities. Eight of Pentacles, I dedicate myself to what I believe in. Okay. Joyful opportunities. Milk and honey, chop wood. Number fifty one. Five plus one is six. Six is balance. They both add up to six. <laughs> balance, balance, balance.
3 plus 8 is 11. Sorry, my brain went somewhere for a second. You've entered a sweet time in your life, enjoying the land of milk and honey that everyone wants to experience. It's an interlude that feels more languid than ambitious when all your senses are awake to the unlimited possibilities in the universe. These times are precious and only come when you are in your authentic zone, wearing the world as a loose garment, not wanting yet able to be nourished in ways both tangible and subtle. Abundance is an energy that you are living you are a living part of. All your needs are being met. You are given the gift of nourishment in every form. Hmm. You know, these death cycles are gifts. I know they're hard to get through. Sometimes they're a gift, and sometimes they come long overdue. Chop wood. These are the times when the big dream is meant to lie dormant in your consciousness so that you can pay attention to the simple chores in your life. Consider why pruning a tree is the forerunner of delighting in the beautiful bloom in the beautiful yeah beautiful blooms when it is in full blossom the mundane act of pulling off dead leaves watering the soil and then leaving it to let nature take its course is an important step in manifestation taking your attention away from your goals brings you into a state of receptivity this is the deeper purpose for releasing attachment. When you engage in everyday tasks in a meditative, contemplative way, you clear your energy to receive your aha moments, which bring you ever closer to what you seek. Somebody needed that. You created this situation and you have the power to change it. This is from the Archangel Michael. Thank you for letting me lean on your strength and for reminding me that my personal po reminding me of my personal power. Please guide me to manifest and heal according to divine will, creating peace and blessings for everyone involved. Focus on divine and perfect health. God and Archangel Michael, thank you for continuously reminding me to focus upon perfect health and for guiding my actions so that I can, so that they can support my well-being. All right. Nice. This may be stressing some of you out to the point where you're just not healthy. All right. We're going to pause, clear the decks, and move on to Earth. Okay, Earth signs, let's pull from the crystal power. Quick shuffle. Top and a bottom and leave it alone. Wisdom Oracle. Angel Michael. All right. Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. And this is another deck that will be replaced after the first of the year. Getting a little old and beat up, that's for sure. Okay. 
Okay. You're releasing a bird and the challenge. Going inside, finding the inner light. Could be a fire sign or a Virgo you're dealing with. Princess of Wands, Princess of Swords, Six of Pentacles, and the Ten of Cups. Six of Swords, Princess of Cups both in the reverse. Ah, whoa. Huh. High Priestess, the Sun, and the Two of Cups is why that's all happening. Queen of Cups at the bottom of the deck. Loving yourself first. Doing what's best for you. Or the other person doing what was best for them. Swords reversed. Okay, this came out without intention. This is going to go there. Something about a defeat. Talk to me about this Princess of Swords. What's this communication coming in? Talk to me about this Princess of Swords. Eight of Pentacles. Could be work related, could be job related. The Moon Revert Clarity. Resolving of drama. Five of Wands reversed. Why the Six of Pentacles? Boss up. A ship's coming in. Huh. Something you've been waiting for. King of Swords. Nice. Nice. All right. More conversations. Could be a promotion for some of you. Why the Ten of Cups?
Page of Pentacles. Four of Wands. Nice. Okay. A little bit of everything for your Earth signs. Stability. Happy family. Talk to me more about this Page of Pentacles. Definitely some celebration. King of Pentacles and the Lovers. All right. Why the Lovers? Oh gosh, don't tell me that. All of a sudden you're desirable? Someone or something coming back? That feels a little gold digger, just saying. Has something to do with this. And in the past it was a defeat. Some of y'all might have a gold digger coming back. Let's go down and address this real quick. Why the high priestess? I felt this was like return. Seven of Wands reversed. Defeat. Unanswered questions. There may have been a strong pull to someone. Didn't know why. Knight of Pentacles. Ah. Whole fam damnly almost. Okay. There was a lack of healing. There was a defeat. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Maybe you didn't have a whole lot to offer and they're like, no, nah, I'm good. No, I'm good. Kind of left you defeated. Why the sun? Why the sun? Okay, I'm not taking 20 cards. I'll take you. And I'll take you. The rest of you got dropped. Three of Pentacles reversed, Temperance reversed. Judgment reverse. You found your happiness. You found your sunshine. You loved yourself. Oh, there she is. Queen of Pentacles. Now the whole fam damn is here. Yeah! So what if it didn't come together? So what if they didn't want to be patient with me? You loved yourself. You found your own self-worth. You buried this. You said to hell with it. Tell me about this Two of Cups. Eight of Wands. Communication with other people. Possibly a new connection. Hermit reversed in the shadow side. Why the shadow side? Two of cups reversed. I 
Hearing, feeling, sensing, not into it. Not into it. Could have been a series of trauma bonds for you somewhere along the way. Became burdensome, that constant defeat. Avoidance. Now you got to deal with it. And then it comes back around at a weird time. Now they want to offer you something? Possibly an apology? Now they want to pick you? Now they want to drudge this up? Now you're being noticed? Talk to me about this Six of Swords reverse for Earth. Cups reversed. You ain't going for it. No. It will be forever the seed that did not grow. You're not going to go for it. You don't want their pentacle now. You're not interested. Why the page of cups reversed? Ten of cups. You're good. You're good. You don't want their cup. You're not interested. Magician at the bottom of the deck. This person might be slightly manipulative, so watch out for that. Super weird, guys. All right, let's go over. Let's go over these. Eight of Cups, I accept my situation without resistance. And the Hermit, I follow my own path. Finally on the path to healing, introspection, self-acceptance. Things are going to start going your way. That's amazing. You accepted what came to you, and good things came to you. That's awesome. All right, 33, chaos and conflict. Three plus three is six. Orphaned, number five, the number of change. Let's run through this real quick. Number 33. Number 33. Opposing forces come together to create a turbulent atmosphere but consider the value of chaos that serves you, you well as you become unmured by it. Scattered to the winds, you leave behind the parts of yourself you no longer need and disperse seeds to reinvent yourself anew. Although the conflict appears to exist externally, its essence is also internal, projected outward and causing disarray. You may find yourself at cross purpose with someone else facing a storm you feel you can't control yet every person yet yeah, every storm passes and chaos leads to a reordering of things conflict provides a way to see more than one side of a situation look upon this just as a moment in time when you need to take shelter and step away from the fray don't be eager to fight this is a time to understand rather than to be understood. This is beautiful earth signs. Talk to me about orphaned. Talk to me about orphaned. We're all meant to have connections with other people within our families, society, and the larger culture. No man is an island. It's important to recognize when being a part of rather than separate from is essential for your well-being. The issue at hand is the need to find where you fit. Be sure your core, be true to your core truths and values. Perhaps you no longer identify with a group or community the way you did before and need to find a new situation. You might be feeling a deep sense of loss or confusion. Address the need for belonging and know that you will find your place with others of like mind and spirit. To okay to let go of pressure to fit in, 
Not everyone will understand you. It's time to move on. Okay. Cool, cool. You're on the right path from the Archangel Michael. Archangel Michael, I call upon you now. Thank you for giving me loud and clear guidance that I easily understand. Thank you for motivating me and filling me with courage and confidence to make healthful life changes. Detach from the situation. Archangel Michael, I ask you to use your flaming sword to cut any attachment of fear or drama so that I may be centered in the knowingness that peace is everywhere within me and in this situation. Earth signs, that is absolutely beautiful. I think that all fit together pretty well. All right. We're going to pause, clear the decks, and move on to air. All right, air. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Let's... Get your crystal power. Your wisdom oracle. your Archangel Michael. Hereford reversed, eight of wands reversed. I'm not calling it yet. Let's see what the rest of the cards have to say first. Knight of wands reversed. King of cups reversed. Two of wands reversed. Emotional closing off. Stuck at a crossroads. Lack of forward movement, why? Death reversed. Six of swords reversed. Seven of cups. Something didn't come to an end. Incomplete death cycle. Somebody may have fought it. Something came back. Caused confusion. Possibly may have caused something else to go awry with you, air signs. Hangman reversed. The Eight of Cups. Eight of Swords at the bottom of the deck causing anxiety. Some of you may be in a cage of your own thoughts. Mental prison of sorts. I see you staying hung up on it or someone staying hung up on you unless you or the other person finally chooses to move on. All right. One on the Hermit reversed. Hermit. Hierophant. Hierophant reversed. Sorry. Justice reversed. Empress reversed. Wasn't going to grow. I mean, it didn't grow. Could have been a missed opportunity. Someone felt it was unfair, possibly why they're still hung up. It wasn't growing. It wasn't meant to grow. May not have been meant to grow. This may not have just may not have been meant to be. Why the eight of wands reversed? Why the eight of wands reversed? Why the eight of wands reversed? 
Why the eight of wands reversed? Nine of wands. Standoffish, combative energy. No forward movement, possibly no communication. Talk to me about the Knight of Wands. And there it is. No communication, hung up. Mental prison. Anxiety. Walk out of that anytime you want. Karma, judgment, possibly somebody's trying to resurrect it. Or make it a final judgment call. It is 20, that is divisible by 10 and 2. So it's decisions and endings. Hermit reverse, somebody not wanting to walk the path. So, yeah, this, this, this is avoidance of an ending. This is someone trying to resurrect it. Confusion, anxiety, King of Cups reversed. King of Cups reversed. Six of Wands, yet another return card. You're trying to stay emotionally closed off to it. They're trying to get your attention and jaded because you're not giving it. Why well, the two of ones reversed? Yet you're still in a mental prison about it. Temperance reversed at the crossroads. Negative energy. Impatience. Page of Wands. Talk to me, talk to me, talk to me. Sometimes when people bombard you, it impedes you from being able to make a decision. You feel like you're a little bit bombarded. I feel like you, I feel like you knew it wasn't meant to be, and you knew it wasn't meant to grow, but someone keeps pushing. Talk to me about death reversed, why it's all happening. Talk to me about death reversed. Talk to me about death reversed. Ace of Wands. Start over. Do over. A lot of wands here. A lot of wands here. World reversed. I want to start over. I still, I still hold a fire for you. I want to strike that match again. Six of swords. Talk to me about the six of swords. Talk to me about the six of swords reversed. Disconnect of a union. Still hung up. They're not happy. This, oh my god, that feels so codependent. Hung up as F. The sun's not shining in my world without you. Seven of Cups. Why the Seven of Cups? King of Swords. Ten of Cups. You know what's got to go to make you happy. You just wanted to end the conflict. You just wanted the conflict to end. Both internal and external. I think you did what was best for you. Cut them out. And they keep trying to come back, putting you in this 
state of mental prison. I mean, this feels slightly stalkerific. I haven't seen the stalker card yet, but they just will not let this go. Ha! Huh! Speaking of which! <laughs> Sorry, I don't mean to laugh, but it's funny because that is notoriously the the stalker card of the tarot with <laughs> the Knight of Swords. Just when I say I haven't seen it yet, it shows up at the bottom of the deck. Talk to me. Talk to me about this hangman reversed, please. Talk to me about the hangman reversed. I don't mean to laugh, but that was just really funny and creepy at the same time. Talk to me about it. Knight of Wands reversed. You do not want to move forward with this. You don't want to communicate. You don't want to offer them anything. They want You want them to stop offering you stuff. You just want to put an end to this. Page of Pentacles. They just keep offering you things, trying to manipulate you. Trying to pull your puppet strings. I don't want to scream black magic, but if that's their thing, they may be trying to use it. They just keep... They, they keep pulling your strings. Talk to me about the Eight of Cups. The final moving on. Knight of Swords. Talk to me about the Knight of Swords. Three of Wands. They're just gonna keep... They're, they're gonna keep waiting. You're gonna try to move on and try to move on try to move on. They're just going to keep waiting. Four pentacles at the bottom of the deck. I feel like it meant eventually they might let go. I think you have to cut communication off entirely. You may have to block this person. You may have to permanently lock that door. As long as you keep that door open, they're just going to keep trying to come back. The chariot. I go forward with confidence. Also a card of putting distance between you and someone else. Could be physical, could be mental or emotional. Two of Wands, I focus on what I want and make it happen. You know what you want. You're not at the crossroads anymore. You've picked a path. Start walking it. Yin, number two. All that glitters. Yin, number two. This is a time of calculated receptivity as you gracefully await what is coming to you, ready to accept it when it appears. Yin does not involve frozen dreams or even resting but rather consciously allowing things to flow to you, poised to receive the bounty that will be made available to you. It implies sensitivity as you alertly study the actions of others and contemplate how they will affect you and yours. Remember, you must make space for miracles to appear. Be the shaped, not the shaper. And you'll see how quickly your dreams manifest. Hmm. Number It's only human to want to adorn yourself with trinkets and paint. A pretty picture of oneself. 
It's natural to want to acquire the trappings of status or to deny them as a statement of rebellion. But if it sparkles, is it better? Whether it's a fast car, a big house, a title or position, the stamp of authority, or the sparkling of diamonds, these icons let you know something about a person, place or thing, or do they? The truth is that people seek to acquire things because of what they will do for them and how they symbolically will elevate them and then make them more attractive. This card signals that it's time to see beyond the adornments and probe underneath the surface. Learn to recognize the masks people wear and the motives underlying them. Imagine that all the glitters is gone. Would you still desire the person or object? Okay. Archangel Michael, shield yourself. Archangel Michael, I ask you to protect me and my loved ones, my vehicle and my home with your powerful shield. Surround us in your purple light, which allows only pure love to penetrate. Please stay with me day and night. And keep my loved ones safe. I feel like somebody needed that, especially certain parts of this are resonating. Detach from this situation. Archangel Michael, I ask you to use your flaming sword to cut any attachment to fear or drama so that I may be centered in the knowingness that peace is everywhere within me and this situation. Mmm, air signs. Okay. Okay. We're going to clear the decks and we're going to move on to water. All right, water. Let's get you down and call it a read for the week. Water signs, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Let's make sure. Yep, okay. One more. Speaking truth this week. Secrets coming out. I don't know if that chair it reversed is the closing of a gap between you or something coming to a dead stop after truth. Ace of Pentacles reversed. Four of Cups. Five of Swords reversed. Contemplation of a cup. Defeat at the end of the week. Seed that didn't grow. Tell me why. I don't know if that's codependency or what that Nine of Pentacles reversed is. Happiness, things coming into alignment. Hang up. Seven of Cups, Exploring Options, 
not letting it get to you too much. Six of Swords at the bottom of the deck. Looks like there may be a moving on. All right, talk to me. What's this chariot reversed about? Talk to me about the chariot reversed for the challenge for the week. What are we doing? Ace of Rods, closing a gap, new start, reigniting something. What's the Ace of Pentacles reversed? What's the Ace of Pentacles reversed? That's a seed that didn't grow. The seed that didn't grow. Is this what you're reigniting? Page of Pentacles reverse, Ten of Pentacles. Ah! Okay. Why the Ten of Pentacles? Page of Swords. Stagnation. Someone having something to offer but not coming forward. One on the page of Pente Knight of Pentacles reversed. Two of Wands. Okay, that tells me why it didn't grow. You let go, you move forward toward the world. Communication. High priest. Whatever you're trying to ignite may already be in something committed. Because they moved on. Or more. Ten of Swords. Painful end to a cycle. Okay. Why the Four of Cups? Oh no. Queen of Pentacles reversed. One more. Page of Wands. One more. Three of Cups. Oh, wow. Contemplating taking your cup. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Wink, wink, flirt, flirt. like the looks of that. I don't like the looks of that at all, y'all. Oh, this is asking for trouble and this is asking for heartache. Five of Swords. Lots of fives, lots of tens. This is back doors. Oh no. Okay, that's super shady. Why the Five of Swords reversed?
please just tell me. Okay. I see at least some of you coming to your senses and letting go and walking away from this. But I feel like there may be a temptation to do something that you shouldn't do. Because this person may already be in a committed relationship and they want a way out. Why the Nine of Pentacles reversed or why this is all happening? Why the Nine of Pentacles reversed? King of Cups reversed. Someone was codependent. Someone was completely emotionally closed off. Emperor. This ended. It ended because it was supposed to. This came to a completion once. Take it however it resonates. Some of y'all might be trying to strike a match. Some of you might be trying to strike a match with you. Foundations were built. You decided to be friends. Yes, the acknowledgement of connection, but something ended. Queen of Cups. Still held a cup for him. You held a cup for yourself more. Why the hanged man reversed? Seven of Swords. Stayed hung up. Kept the secret. Eight of Wands. Stayed in contact. Eight of Pentacles concentrated on work, worked on you. They worked on them. Oh my gosh. This ends with a choice. This ends with a choice. Why the Seven of Cups? Multiple paths here. Pentacles reversed. Please don't get yourself into an uneven situation. Six of Wands, Temperance reversed, Seven of Pentacles reversed. Oh, geez. Be careful with pa which path you choose. Be careful which path you choose. I feel like allowing this return is going to cause negative energy and negative return on investments and something to go back to imbalance. Be careful which cup you choose. Why the Nine of Swords reversed? Ace of Cups reversed. Three of Swords. This is a warning. This is a warning. Three of Wands. You allow this ship to come back in, it may lead to heartbreak and more than one spilled cup. It's 
strength reversed at the bottom of the deck. It's definitely not defeating demons. Okay. This just took a weird turn. Five of swords again. We'll heal myself. Nine of pentacles. I take the time. I need to nurture myself. is a message. This just got real specific real quick. I apologize, but we're gonna run with it. You need if this is like some kind of weird self-soothing thing for somebody you need to find a different way about this. I feel like somebody's about to get sucked into a third party situation or there was one that stopped that's about to get restarted that shouldn't. But do you? Thinker, orphaned, number 44. 4 plus 4 is 8. 8 is the number of infinity. 5 is the number of change. Okay. 44, thinker. The ability to reason and strategize is the focus now. Take things at face value and follow the logical path. Her calculations will prove correct, for in this moment there is no deeper meaning than what is obvious. <coughs> Pardon me. Things are exactly as they seem. You have all the information you need. Keep it simple and you will win the game, the game of life you're playing right now. Do not make something complicated that doesn't need to be complicated. We were all meant to have connections with other people within our families, society, and the larger culture. No man is an island. And it's important to recognize when being a part of rather than separate from is essential to your well-being. This is the issue at hand. Sorry, the issue at hand is the need to find where you fit. Be true to yourself. Oh my gosh, I can't read this right now. Be true to your core values and truths. Perhaps you no longer identify with a group or community the way you did before, you need to find a new situation. You might be feeling a deep sense of loss or confusion. Address the need for belonging and know that you will find your place with others of like mind and spirit. It's okay to let go of the pressure to fit in. Not everyone will understand you. It's time to move on. Okay. Oh, wow. Detach from this situation! Archangel Michael. I ask you to use your flaming sword to cut any attachment or fear or drama so that I may be centered in the knowingness that peace is everywhere within me and in this situation. Focus upon divine and perfect health. God and Archangel Michael, thank you for continuously reminding me to focus upon perfect health for guiding my actions so that they support my well-being. Are you listening? Are you listening? Okay. Friends. Quick outro. If I haven't mentioned it yet, I'll say it again. Um, Christmas Eve and Christmas Day, I will not be reading cards. So your weekly reading will post next Thursday. Hopefully weather permitting. So just be blessed. Have a great next few days and peace, love, and light. See you in the next, friends.